Good day, everyone. Pierpolzi here. Um, the time uh, Verted Vision Observatory. The time is the uh, five or six o'clock, quarter past six in the morning, tenth of March, New York, USA. Right, it doesn't seem much to see there, but I'll uh, slow this down. Now you can go on about five or six, even seven different webcams uh, in America at the moment, and they all show the same thing. Um, well, I'm going to stop this. No, wrong one. Sorry, guys. Right. This is east, obviously south and west. I'm going to take it slow. So you've got two light sources here, right, massive light sources. I've been watching this for an hour now and because uh, I've been hopping between cameras and you can, it's, it's actually gotten bigger, not smaller, but bigger. These two here were just above the clouds about half an hour ago. Now they're massive. Look at the size of that. You know, it's bloody huge. Right, now watch the east come up. Hasn't come up yet. Look at that. What worries me is this residual light over here. <laughs> What's that? Look at that. That's south and that's west. Now, if everyone remembers the um, uh, the one I filmed the other day, the, uh, the observatory down in Antarctica, the, the uh, clout, the, the, whatever it was, came up or went down in the south and it crested the, you could actually see it touch the horizon because the, the actual reflection went straight on the water like, like a normal horizon. So whatever this thing is, it's bloody huge. Right, let's go through it slowly. Right, this is the sun coming up. See, it just drowns these out now. So if you got up now, you wouldn't even see it. There you go, it's gone. This is uh, 6.05. <coughs> Excuse me. So there's nothing there to see at all. There you go. Two distinct spheres of light. You can clearly see them. Then the sun comes up. More. Now, look at the time here. 05.45. Right? And it's brighter now than it's 6.05. Watch. 55. 6.05. No sun. Absolutely nothing. 6.15, same thing. Going back to this little bit of a cloud thing, a sun thing here, which is probably normal. And 5.25. So at 5.25, you've got these. 5.35, you got that. 5.45, it's even brighter. 5.55, it starts going down. 6.05, there's nothing. 6.15, you've got this residual thing here on the north, which is kind of weird in itself. 5.25, I'm not making this up. This is all on the on the sky cam, so you can clearly see it. 
535, 45, 55, 605, 615. Like I said, you've got this residual stuff on the north, which I, which worries me as well. So let's have a look at it upstairs, which is going to be a little bit harder. Now, before we do that, I'll go to this one. Uh, I tried to find out where this was, but it gave me some pretty stupid information. So I can't, I can't tell you where it is in uh, San Diego. Uh, it's called Tierra del Sol. The thing that I find interesting with this is in the east and the west. You've got two light sources here in the west, one one on this side. You can clearly see the, the delineation between the two, and one on this side. Now, it is – I checked the time, and that is actually the right time. It's 13 – it was 13.03 when I checked, so it's 13.13 .13 at the moment. So it's three, 13 minutes past three in the morning. So excuse my ignorance, but if someone writes in and says that, look, it's – it's bordering on this massive city that's, you know, pumping out a nuclear power station light every pulsing out every five seconds. And, um, I'll take heed of it, but at the moment, the same thing. Let's stop it. There's the east. There's the west again. Look, if you remember the west on the other one, it was, uh, it was south over here where it had a light. Now, as I said, you can go on five or six, probably more, webcams in America at the moment, and there's, an, there's a light in the south. So don't forget, these guys are a little bit behind on the hours. Uh, Kings Valdosta, um, Bill Snyder, a couple others. You could actually see the same thing. Sorry, I've had a long day. Um, so this one's just a little bit further over. But you can just see the creepings of it coming across here. See the light going across? So I'm guessing that this is going to end up going exactly the same. That there looks just like a normal sort of light to me. I don't know what it is. But you can clearly see the two lights here. Or the two, what's the name's light? One there and one there. Look, comes up, goes down. Comes up, goes down. Comes up, goes down. That's a worry. So you've got two lights there and one light in the east. Now it's two hours before sunlight. You've got that. I can't see anything there. Look, it could be residual town lighting, but geez, it'd have to be bright to do that. Oh, look how bright that is. That's, that's too bright. Can you see the, the, the two light things here? There's the middle. Goes out that side, comes down, goes out that side. And like I said, it's quarter past three in the morning. Yeah, everyone happy with that? Like I said, oh, if anybody knows any different, tells me that the uh, you know there's some Air Force base right there that's pumping out all this light or whatever, be happy to hear it. Right, let's go back to the other one. Uh, okay, averted vision. <clears throat> right, 29 seconds left. I'll let you watch this and you can just clearly follow the lights. Look how bright it is. You can clearly see the lights. 